As long as there is pain and suffering in the world, there's a need for us to tell our stories, and this is mine. Hi, I'm Julie Fillinger. I was born and raised in Columbus, Ohio, by parents who loved me and sisters who doted over me. I went off to college and became a nurse. I met my husband, who's my soulmate. We had two beautiful children. We started to have uh, some challenges in marriage, but I really had nothing to cry about. That is, until I started suffering losses. My biggest life-changing event occurred when my firstborn son, Nicholas, died. Nicholas was a beautiful and courageous child. He lived every day with so much passion. He cared deeply. He fought for what was right. He tried out some different sports uh, that he wasn't successful at until he discovered he was gifted at running. It was so fun to watch him compete with that same courage and passion that he lived with every day. He died shortly before his 17th birthday and my dream world was rocked in devastation. It's been 10 years since Nicholas died and I want to share my grief journey in hopes that you, like me, will learn how to have courage to live again after loss. Courage to live started as me journaling. There was so much pain inside and I need a way for it to come out. And when I shared that journal, I discovered that I was not alone in my pain. There's lots of suffering in the world. And so the journal became a book. And in the book, I tell you about the raw and honest suffering that I endured, how painful it was, but also that I discovered joy and sorrow could coexist. I give practical ways that I managed my grief. One of my favorite chapters talks about what people did and did not do that was very helpful when I was grieving. But the most important chapters talk about the hope that I have because of God's plan for eternal life. I want to use this book to encourage others. So if you or someone you know is suffering, then please go to my website at juliefillinger.com and you can purchase this book, Courage to Live, Learning to Live Again After Loss. You also can go to my publisher, karispublishing.com. I want to thank them for taking a chance on me as a new author.